in a world where there's nowhere left to hide, nowhere left to run. But you need a new pentatonic lick? We've got you covered. Hi there. Today we are going to show you a pentatonic lick that will hopefully change your life for the better. If not, maybe we can talk about something that's else that will work for you and your life issues. But for now, we're going to play in the key of E minor. So this is going to be based off of the 12th fret of your guitar in this pentatonic box. That hopefully you already know. Uh, the sweet line six tones. And what we're going to use for this lick today is we're going to be playing off of the first, the second, and the third strings. So the E, the B, and the G string. Okay? The first note of this lick is going to be on the 14th fret of the G string, and you're going to bend it up a full step. So the note you're going for is this. We're bending that A to an, a B. Okay? And then we're going to skip up to the E string and have our finger in place on the high E here. So it's gonna sound like this. And the, kind of the way I play it is just to do that first bend with a downstroke and then an upstroke for the second note, okay? So we're, we're not doing the traditional blues lick that you may know that goes like this. We're skipping over the middle string, okay? So that's section one. But we're gonna keep that bar in place because the next part, we grab the D note on the B string, so that's the 15th fret, and we're going to pick that note and have our index finger in place so I can pull away the pinky down to the B note, okay? So, so far we have this. Now we're going to incorporate a very small sweep. So you're going to get your 14th fret back down on the G string, keep the 12s down on the B and the E strings, and you're going to uh, do nothing but a downstroke. Okay, so hopefully you can see that. I'll try to zoom in on it. But we're doing nothing but a sweep across those. And yes, they are going to ring together like that, but that's okay. All right, so now, so far we have this. All right, the last part of this life-changing lick is you're going to, once again, grab the pinky on the D note on the 15th fret of the second string and pick it and pull it away down to the B. Okay, so here's every section, one after the other. Okay. Right? So obviously the faster I got going, I know the bend tends to get a little more shallow and that just happens when you're going that fast. This is a lick that works really nicely at a slow tempo. Right? It can be very kind of bluesy sounding, but it also works for that faster type lick. So hopefully that was a good explanation for you. If you like it, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the like button. I appreciate it very much and I'll be back with something new for you soon. Thank you.